Before we even get started in this video, I'd like to shout out a couple people who helped me achieve Bankai. Without their help, this wouldn't even be possible, so I want to take the time to thank them for it. I'm just going to shout the names out since I don't feel like making a paragraph for each and every one of them, since that'll take forever. Oh, brother, this guy stinks! I know, I know. That seems shitty, but I just, just know I can't be asked for real. This video's taken a while already, so here's the people that made it all happen. Ghost, Kev, Jake, and John. I am so grateful for these four people for not only being in my life, but helping me achieve Bankai. Just know I thank you. Now that's out of the way, I could show you a little compilation of what I had to go through. And don't worry, I'll tell you all the requirements I did at the end of the video. So stay tuned and enjoy. I'm being teleported. Oh, I got it! First try. Okay, okay. We're in this, Kev. We're in this. Okay. Second try! No way! No way! Alright, Jamin. Alright, Jamin. You're in here. <sighs> Alright. The blade is me. 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 Oh no. The blade is me. Oh! Oh! Did I do it? Did I do it? Hold on. What are you doing for? The rest is up to you! Let's go! Let's go! Cause baby now you feel like number one. Shouting right for everyone. Living up your fantasy, you're the brightest star for all to see. Yeah. <laughs> now this next part is stage three, which took me hundreds, if not thousands, of tries to complete. Due to him having hyper armor, cripple, and a broken Bushugama critical that's an AoE. Meanwhile, my Shikai had a shitty critical that only 25% of the animation actually guard breaks, and the cooldown takes longer than the downfall arc, which I somehow beat it. Literally, this Bankai fight had me like, It's over. I'll never defeat him. I can't win. Type shit. I almost defeated him once, but I got cucked by a raid and it insta-killed my Bankai. Thanks, Type Soul. Love you for that. But now, the moment you all have been waiting for. You're about to witness the indomitable human spirit. Also, just to clarify, the Bankai clip is short, so it isn't the full fight, so it's not as simple as it seems. Now, enjoy. He's low. I won! I won! Let's go! Let's fucking go! Let's go! Yes! Griffin! Griffin! 
fighting so hard, man. Crypto! Let's go! Yes. Oh god, I almost fainted, holy shit. W! Holy shit, I feel so dizzy. Oh my god, from that screaming. Bro. My god, I almost made myself faint. Fuck. You got Bankai now. Now you're a fucking tomato. For real. My god. And now, last but not least, you thought I forgot, didn't you? Well, so these are the requirements for Soul Reapers only. So sorry, Arancars, and sorry, Quincy's. So here's what you gotta do for stage one. You gotta get 175 Hueco Mundo raid wins. This does not count for Katakura or One and Reach. Second stage is 40 grips. They have to be elite grade, doesn't work with any other grade. But it can be the same person, so you can get like a buddy or something. You also need 150 hollow kills and 5 bow bow kills. You could do 3 to 5, but me personally I did 5 and it worked, so do with that information as you will. Now you need to do stage 2 all the requirements without dying. If you die, you are set back to stage 2, the beginning. Yes, you have to repeat stage 2 all over again. Now, if you think that was hard enough, now you have to do stage 2.5, which means you have to talk to Kisuke again, and you have to find your Zanpakuto. There's a bunch of blades around, but you have to pick the right one. There's tutorials on it to help you out on YouTube, so. Now, if you fail this, you don't have to restart back to stage 2, the beginning. You have to get two player grips of different factions to reset the two hour cooldown. But if you die during this, however, you will be sent back to stage 2, the beginning. But if you do manage to complete it, well, congratulations. Now you get to fight your Bankai. And you can die during this stage, so you don't have to worry about any setbacks or anything like that. But if you do fail the Bankai fight, you need two player grips of different factions. However, it could be any rank. Yup, any rank. Doesn't have to be elite grade or anything like that. You can literally kill a fucking fresh spawn and it will count, as long as they're a different faction. Now, depending on your Bankai, it might take a really long time, just like mine, for example. But... Yeah, just keep trying, never give up, and you'll beat it eventually. Good luck to y'all. I'll see you later. But yeah, like literally, I... If you come out and jump scare me, you're a slut!